Andy Warhol left behind a lot of self-portraits. It's an article in the New York Times. There was the black and white shot from a photo booth from 1963. But one of his most telling self-portraits wasn't a portrait at all in a conventional sense. Between 1976 and 87, the artist regularly dictated his thoughts, fears, feelings, and opinions about art, himself, and the world over the phone to his friend and collaborator, Pat Hackett. In 1989, two years after his death, Hackett published the Andy Warhol Diaries, a transcribed, edited, and condensed version of their phone calls. And now, more than three decades later, the Andy Warhol Diaries has come to Netflix as a bittersweet documentary series directed by Andrew Rossi. We'd like to check that out. Andy Warhol made a hell of an impact, even in the punk rock movement and uh, New York City decadence.